So that was D'Angelo's Lady, written by D'Angelo and Raphael Sadiq. It's in the key of F sharp major. And uh, basically three chords. You're going to have your G sharp minor. Or, I'm sorry. Yes, your G sharp minor, your D sharp minor, and your E major. So I'll, I'll break that down for you. And the running bass line. <clears throat> so the opening way that you're hearing the song is you hear the, the bass line in the, in the guitar, in the bass guitar. We're going to play that first. It's going to be D sharp, F sharp, G sharp, A sharp. So you're going to play all the black keys first, basically. So you're going to play D, F sharp, G sharp, A sharp together or simultaneously. One, two, three, four, and back to the F. F sharp, and then you're going to play uh, G sharp, F sharp, and D sharp down. Okay, I know my voice is not so great sounding, but that's basically the gist of the harmony in the beginning. sharp minor and then you're gonna add 11th 13th um, that's when I say 11th and 13th for those who are not uh, familiar with music theory in general an 11th and 13th denotes no pun intended additional chords or notes on top of the bass chord so your bass chord is just going to be <coughs> your G sharp minor chord but I'm going to make it I'm going to add more into it so the first notes in this, in this progression is going to be B flat in the right, or B natural, C sharp, F sharp, one, two, three, four, okay, A sharp. Now, the option I give you is you can add another G sharp bass, extend the bass which will be G sharp, D sharp, and D and G sharp in the left. Okay. Okay, so uh, that's up to you, so you can play either. It's the first chord. G sharp, E major. Thirteenth, I believe. Okay, so and that E is not going to be held for too long. So once again, it's going to be G sharp minor. So again, and then you're going to have your D sharp minor chord. Which I tend to think as a, of as a, a B flat minor seventh, but let's get that out of the way, uh, and that will be D sharp, A sharp, D sharp, F natural, or E sharp, and G sharp. So once again, it's going to be from the top. I'm going to call up the chords and just play G, E, D, G, E, D sharp, G sharp, E, D sharp, G. Okay, 
So again, it's going to be a little bit slow, a little bit faster. Now what I'm doing is rolling these chords. But you don't want to make it sound too dramatic. You just want to keep the main rhythm going in the bass. the bass, I play E flat, uh, E bass down here, or an octave E. You don't have to play that, I just play it to make it sound more dominant. But uh, on a regular piano it may sound like too much bass, so you can do the regular one note intervals on the bass hand. So that's pretty much it. And again, after you play the you know, you resolve to the the G sharp chord or G sharp minor chord. You can play that bass line. Bum, 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 bum. That's it for the D'Angelo tutorial for Our Lady. I broke down the chords. I'll, I'll post the bass line method or the bass chords and the, the main harmony chords in the right hand. And that will be that for the tutorial. Any questions, let me know. And I will post the site where the sheet music is posted for the song so you can play along with it actually in real time. And if you have any more questions, like I said, just send me an email or send me a message and I'll get back to you. Thank you for watching and enjoy the song.